questions remaining tonight for people with relatives at Brighton Rehab and Wellness Center in Beaver County. This comes after that facility says it's now presuming that all of its staff and residents are positive. Amy Watt has spoke with a woman whose mother lives there. Amy. Ken, that woman tells me she has no idea if her mom has COVID-19 or whether or not she's been tested. However, if her mom does have symptoms, she says they will give her a call. That hasn't happened yet. Now, her mom is 78-year-old Dorothy Umstead. She's been living at the facility since July of last year. Brighton Rehab said today it is not going to count test results and will instead presume all of the residents and staff may be positive while continuing to isolate and treat the the patients who do show symptoms. The facility says taking this approach will allow it to be more protective of anyone who is asymptomatic, something Dorothy's daughter isn't taking very well. Well, that is heartbreaking. It's absolutely heartbreaking. A lot of those people have children at home, um, the people that work there. Are they really testing? Are they testing after they're sick? I don't know. If they have mild symptoms, there's really no necessity to test them. Of course, uh, if they start to have significant symptoms and require medical treatment, then they would go to a, a hospital uh, to be assessed and to receive that treatment, and then the hospital would decide uh, up, upon testing. But that idea of probable cases is something that we are working on. Brighton says it's following safety guidelines and staff are using N95 masks and protective equipment to stay safe. Residents who need masks are also wearing them. Now, in a statement this afternoon, Brighton Rehab says it is joining with an increasing number of healthcare professionals urging all Americans to presume they are positive and to do everything they can to help stop the spread of this virus. Reporting live in Beaver County, Amy Wattis, KDKA News.